We begin here with news new this morning, a new way to get a taste of New Mexico history. Literally within the next week or so, the New Mexico History Museum will have a traditional orno or oven up and running, and the museum has big plans for it. News 13's Fernanda Lopez explains. It'll be a delicious taste of history. They're seen in pueblos around the state, but their origin dates back to Islamic influences in Spain. In the documentation on the palace, um, there was a quote found from General Stephen Watts Kearney, who came to Santa Fe at the end of the Mexican-American War and claimed this is American territory. New Mexico History Museum educator Melanie Laborwood says he wrote about the Odnos in the courtyard of the Palace of the Governors, which is part of the History Museum in Santa Fe. And so we thought it would be really fun to put one back. Over the last several weeks, museum volunteers have worked to install this Spanish-style adobe horno, made entirely out of clay bricks. So they introduced this particular style of cooking to the um, indigenous people here in New Mexico. The plan is to invite museum guests to dig in and experience the state's history in a new way. We hope to use it regularly to do demonstrations for whether it's bread baking or roasting corn, if we get ambitious, we'll be making cookies, turkeys. There are ideas to invite traditional bakers to do recipe swaps and get the public involved in baking. Guests will also be able to buy the bread cooked in the Ordno in the museum shop. We're always looking for new ways to bring history to come to life, and this is exactly the kind of thing that'll make a really memorable visit for the people who come here from all over the country and all over the world. The focus to keep it interactive. When the Ordno needs remudding, the public will again be invited to lend a hand. I think that'll be really exciting way to look at history. Fernanda Lopez, KRQE News 13. Museum educators say the Orno will also provide endless lessons for area kids on school trips, not just history, but a taste of math and science as well. It should be up and running within, as we mentioned, the next week or so. So countdown's on. How cool is that? Very yeah. neat. I love it when things get interactive. You know, you go mm -hmm. to learn about something and you get to be involved. Yeah, yeah. pretty cool.